Hello, this is Bino. Last week we made a video on the third hand. This device can help you in an aerial rescue to bring an injured climber down. Anyhow, after that video, we had some comments that, you know, mentioning that you can only use that on a friction cord. So what we're gonna do is try it on mechanical hitches and see how it fares. All right, let's get to it. Here we have set up a zigzag with a chicane. Um, this will be what I'll climb on. I'm going to use a, a rope wrench and a friction hitch. So what we'll have is Noah will go up, I'll ascend up to him, and then I'll do just like I would be rescuing somebody. I'll get my lanyard, I'll connect it to him, and then I'll get the third hand and connect it to the zigzag, and then I'll proceed down and see how it fares. We're also going to use the akimbo and then the rope runner and see if this um, third hand will work with all of them. Now I'm going to proceed up to the top of the tree where Noah is and I'll do the aerial rescue. Now that I reach Noah, I'm going to sit down on my rope wrench here, take off my foot ascender and my knee ascender. I'll go get that out of my way. Put it off to the side. And once I do that, I'm gonna come over to Noah. And I'm gonna get my lanyard connected to him. That way, if anything were to go wrong, he won't fall to the ground. So, lanyard through his saddle, connect to my D. Now I'm gonna tighten up to him. Once I get him snug, He's close to me. Now I know he's not gonna get away from me. I'll grab my third hand. I'm gonna connect it to the post. One of my posts in front of me. Now I've got the third hand and I'll put it above his zigzag. And now I'm gonna tighten up. Whoops. So now I know that's enough that when I decide to sin, I can bring him down. So simple thing, bring him down. There we go, all the way down to the ground. And then once I get down to the ground, slowly manipulate him till he's on the ground. So that looks pretty good. Looks like the third hand works with a zigzag. Now I'm gonna go to Noah, I'll grab him. I'll throw the lanyard back in. Pull him tight to me. I know I know he's not getting away. Grab out my third hand. Connected to my center, my side post. And then I'll go to the top of his akimbo and I'll connect. And now what I'll do is I'm gonna tighten up the akimbo and make sure that I got tension. Okay. I'll grab him and I'll come down. slowly 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 till I get to the ground and now that I'm at the ground I let him down there I go bring him all the way down all right there we go now we're going to use that third hand on the rope runner now that I've reached the top I'm going to disconnect my chesty all right got that clear my knee ascender Take it off and I'll stow it off to the side here. Okay, and my foot is under. Now I'm gonna swing around and get in position to for Noah. Throw my lanyard back in. It's always important to put that lanyard on because at no point could he fall. And now I'm gonna tighten it and up. Now I have him real close to me.
grab me now my third hand here clicking it into this side post all right now I'm gonna tighten it up okay now that it's tight now I'm gonna cradle Noah and I'll start going down and there we go as I slow down it slows down it actually works like a charm all the way down to the ground bring it on there we go there we are looks like all three mechanicals work well with this third hand so the concern was will this third hand work on mechanicals and as we showed it worked well I mean on every single one um, first on this zigzag then the akimbo and then the rope runner pro um, this boat clip right above it put a little tension it's just like your hand hence the name third hand um, yeah I think it worked really well and it's a good um, piece of kit that you could have in the emergency rescue kit that you have hopefully you have um, I had some other questions asking like if I could or if you could make this third hand with good equipment like rated rope and carabiners you definitely can do that um, the boat clip would not never be rated but this is probably the better thing like a regular carabiner wouldn't really work because a lot of times it's a little bit wider it might like slip through a boat clip is something you probably have to have you could definitely use rated rope and a press it cord uh, a good pulley and a real carabiner like a good rated carabiner and they were saying like they'd like to use it maybe on their saddle the thing is, if you have a, something like the third hand that's meant for an emergency kit, um, if you're using it on your saddle and you use it for other things, one of the pieces might get lost and maybe when it's time to use it, you won't be able to use it in that way. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you like what we do. And by all means, share our videos. Take care, we'll see you next time.